Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we're gonna take a quick look at the four main categories of cloud services that you'll find on a cloud service provider. So a cloud provider can have hundreds of cloud services that are grouped into various types of services, and the four most common types, I like to call these the four core, uh, is, uh, and specifically for infrastructure as a service, and we'll talk about IAS in the next video, uh, but we have compute, so imagine having a virtual computer that can run applications, programs, and code. Then you have storage. So imagine having a virtual hard drive that can store files. You have networking. So imagine a virtual network being able to define internet connections or network isolations. And you have databases. So imagine a virtual database for uh, storing reporting data or a database for general purpose web applications. So those are the four core. And we're gonna give them uh, some additional um, attention this course around the Google Cloud offering because we're gonna see them in the exam and that's usually what these fundamental certifications are testing you on, okay? And so for Google, they have uh, 60 plus cloud services. They have fewer than the other ones, but for them, it's less about having a lot of services and just having very high quality services. So uh, it's by design, you know? So when you see like Azure has 200, uh, it's it's a little bit too much. For GCP is like, okay, we're just gonna make sure that these services are multi-purpose. So you don't have to have as many as these other ones, okay? And I just want to say that the term cloud computing can be used to refer to all categories, even though it has compute in the name. So you'll, you'll say, and I said this, mm, I didn't say it up there, but you know, you might say cloud computing, but you really mean everything, right? It doesn't matter what it is, everything is cloud computing, okay?